Hey everyone, what's happening? This is Matt Mover. I hope you're all doing awesome. And in this game, I'm playing on a 45 hertz server, Operation Locker on the PS4. Haven't played this in ages. I'm running Assault with the M16. Let's do this. Oh, and I've got an ACOG as well. Let's try to get an angle in. Hopefully you got people watching my back on the stairs, but I really don't know. And you've got people watching the front as well. And this place is always a madhouse. Let's get a reload in. Let's try and take a angle here but you've got snipers there there always usually are got people to revive here and things like that but they've been revived so that's cool got to watch that left side as well enemy there All right, well he has moved Grenades. And we've got enemies coming in from hide. No one watching the back. Very disappointing. But what can you do? Usually I take well, usually I take that role, but maybe I should have done. Let's get into the tower. Might get a better angle from there. Right, a couple of kills just there. These guys are running out. That means that area is clear from the top. Anyone at the bottom? Let's have a look. No. No one but me. And another enemy. Right, I pre-fired that because I knew they're going to come up and I had no health bag. I had to wait a little while for the health bag to come back up. So those guys have come up. Let's do something about them. Okay. Man, I haven't played this game in ages. I feel so rusty, but... It is what it is. Rusty or not, you've got to do what you have to do. Is there an enemy in the centre or is he downstairs? I'm not sure. The minimap says someone's in there. And these guys got revived. enemies down here. Ooh. Man, just got that prone down jump down, but he still managed to get that final hit. Unbelievable. Seven. Needed a few more hits, maybe just one more. Got that kill assist. 73 damage on that guy. Need to do a little bit more. How are we doing so far? 10 and 3, okay. It's not the best, but it certainly isn't the worst, that's for sure. He is up there. Let's get another grenade in. Just to get a little bit of cover while I go up. And now we've got a position. Position we can defend. Right, we've got most objectives. 
Now that we've got B, we can pretty much steam right in there. Our friendly's doing an excellent job. These guys are downstairs, though. Might be worth trying to tackle them from behind. Maybe. Let's see what happens. If they are downstairs, which I'm guessing they are. Now we've got some shooters there. Trying to use that position. Didn't work. We got a machine gunner in there as well. Ah. Really is hard to see. Oh, he came in from up above. This guy Chindi's not too bad. It's not the first time he's got me. A 19 and 5 is doing all right. I need to get myself up there on the points capture board, but. hit by that M8283 mid that thing one shot kill most ranges anything above a stupid amount of range might not get a one shot kill but this thing oh yeah got that down take these guys down and I've got that kill assist couldn't quite do the job though. Maybe I should have threw a grenade, but I'll tell you what. When you pick this game up after a very long time, all you're thinking is just pull the trigger, man. Just pull the flipping trigger. Alright, what am I gonna do now? Take that guy out who's already sort of been taken out as he dropped down. Bravo's been taken. Go in from the outside, maybe. Maybe. Let's just go out and see what happens. It doesn't really matter because I'll find out where the enemies are, even if I get taken out and they're not here. Let's just look behind anyone going to D, maybe. No, but there is a sniper out there. Can't see him. Again, if I get taken out by the sniper, at least I'm, I'll sort of know where he is, roughly, so I'm not really fussed. He probably is around A somewhere, though. Drop a little med bag here. Run down the middle. Maybe run down the left, actually. Might be hard for him to track, track me if he's up there. Got a few friendlies down here as well. Still hear those shots coming in. Come down the side here. This time's pretty risky because I don't really have anyone with me. So I'm thinking... I just go in or I don't know. Not straight in the middle, forget that. Maybe go around whoa. Maybe go around through here. Where did he go? Alright, I got him down at least. Man, with all this steam and smoke, I couldn't even see anything. Luckily that thing blew up as well. And I got revived. How good is that? See, this is what I'm talking about, guys. This is what I'm talking about with the revives. You never know when you're going to get revived or not, or skipping revives and all that, like BF1. It's just not worth it. Damn, that guy was camouflaged. But he's down. Camping doesn't always work out. You've got to move around in this game, I reckon. In my opinion, one thing that could make Battlefield better, getting rid of prone. I reckon getting rid of prone would make the game a lot better. Simply because people are less inclined to uh, to camp. Ooh, what a shot. Get in there. Get in there with the M320. The bottom line is we'll get behind them. Might be enemies down here, but... Drop down, take a look around, not see anyone. See someone up there. It's been a while since I've got any kills of any kind. How? Got that assist counts as kill. Ah, A94, that's why. But I'm enjoying my M16. I like the free round burst. Might play the A94 another day. 
right now it's m16 day but <laughs> seriously this game the way people the way people pop out it is classic battlefield but the way people sort of jump out and come out of nowhere does shock you sometimes and that shocked me for sure Couldn't get my revive thing going on because I knew those enemies were coming. I'm going to get in there and do some damage. Ah, unlock the angle grip. That's good. Just too risky going out and arriving there. Too risky. No! Quite a long reload time though. I mean, it's not the longest, but it felt long there. Man, I felt like I was around the corner there. Maybe I wasn't. Looking at this angle, it doesn't look like I was. But it felt that way. Let's get myself down here and punish that sniper. Now the only problem with this game sometimes is your friendlies getting into your face. You can't really move left and right then. Man, that aim. That aim was really off. Need to control my recoil a little bit better. It's just too risky going out there. Just put a bit of pressure on. There is a few enemies down there, or there were at least. Maybe they've been taken down. Does look like that does look like they have. Man. Running quite low in ammo. There's gonna be enemies up here, aren't there? Let's bring some of these whoa, 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 whoa. where's those shots? That's where those shots come from. Okay. Okay, let's bring you back. No! Damn you! Couldn't bring my guys back. It's a good thing I sort of checked and waited. Running quite low on ammo right now though. Damn. They're back in that position. Oh no. I knew it. Mini grenade got me. Man, I knew that grenade was coming in. Not enough time to react. Right, we've lost E. Well, we're getting it back, which is good. Just need to watch these angles. As long as we hold these angles, all right. Man, the temptation to get those guys up is really there, but... Cause me getting killed, so I'm not going to do it. No, it's friendly. So good, this game doesn't have friendly fire, unless you're playing hardcore. you coming in. Better pull back. Well, I am in trouble. I'm going to 
get back in, capture C. It's a good thing. Oh, was that a claymore? I think it was. So good, I heard those footsteps, let me tell you. Do you need some help up here, though? Right, we've got that neutralized. I'm hearing these guys sprint around. Okay, we got that flag. Maybe a little too easily. Oh crap! That happened too quickly. If we get C, let's get E. Let's get E back. And we've got loads of friendlies up here, which is good. See, we're on the cusp of victory, but a comeback can happen. That's what makes this game so good. Couldn't do anything there. Let's just go around the side. Go to Delta and uh, try and do some damage. Maybe come in through the other door, cut off for rotation. Good angle to come in from. But we're recapping this. I'll just join. No points for me. No problem. Oh, we lost that. Okay. Wow. Let's get myself back up. That's too hectic for me, in all honesty. Right, got a multi, but not enough to get that triple. Enough to get myself back here, though. Ah. Not enough to escape that guy, though. There's one thing about this game, it's way too many explosions. Pull out of there. I'm really not feeling that. Gonna wanna get around, maybe defend here. My guess is there'll be an easy, and there is. Let's get a couple more kills to try and get that win. These guys throwing these uh, grenades like, like they're just cans or whatever. Tennis balls. Don't even know what I'm saying. All I know is they're throwing it. Getting on C quickly. Quick time damage. Ooh, he was waiting for me. Right there. Yep, he was lucky. I would have taken him out otherwise. I think that's pretty much it, that's me.
Game almost over. Got no friendlies to spawn around. Five tickets left. We've done this. What an amazing game, guys. I mean... Well, there's always a chance for a kill somewhere, isn't there? Two oh seven versus zero, that's a good amount of tickets. Let's see how well we did. Forty one and eighteen, not too bad there. Not my best KD score, but I tell you what, it felt good. It felt like a positive round overall. So I hope you enjoy that gameplay guys and let me tell you if you want to see more Battlefield gameplay, absolutely let me know in the comments below that you've enjoyed that or whether you know what you want to see going forward. But I tell you what, Battlefield four after a long time. I have to be honest does feel more fun than BF1, so controversial, maybe not so much, but I might be playing a little bit more of this going forward, let's see.